uh, the beginning of uh, crypto, once called Web3, there was Bitcoin, there was Ethereum. So if you, you needed to run a node and you don't need to trust anyone. But then there was the proliferation of many chains. And today you see stable coins and you see RWA and everyone has its own chain. And I think it's just going to be more and more. You know, I heard some people saying it's going to a million chains. In each of them, you need to run a node and gain access. So it doesn't make sense. So then the second wave, it's when amazing companies like Alchemy, Quicknode, they presented a solution to that. They say, don't run a node, I'm going to run it for you. If you want to ask me to do something, to send a transaction or a query and information, just ask me to do it. But people in crypto, they know one of the three things that you want to have privacy, you don't want to have single point of failure, and you want to have reliability, which means if I tell you something, that's actually from the blockchain. So what I discovered like four years ago is that everyone is using a few providers. 